we are interested in finding the homogeneity of variances and uh, we have three libraries we have the Ediverse, we have the fallen and also we have the car and the first thing we want to do is we want to read through our data so i want to view my data And in this data, I'm interested in the financial literacy. I want to see if the variances of this, when I compare them to the income, income one, it will be homogeneous. What? Then I say financial literacy. It tells me that I have three categories. I have low, medium, and high. So I want to compare the low, medium, and high income levels are the variances the same or different so i'm going to select two columns column four that is financial literacy and column seven which is uh the income one so if i say val social i have the financial literacy which is low medium and high and also i have the income so the purpose of the homogeneity test is to find out if the variances are equal among the three samples. So I'm going to use the Levin test, and that's my data. I'm going to compare the income and financial literacy. And according to the Levin test, what we normally have to keep in mind is this. The null hypothesis, which you can put a comment here, the null hypothesis, we, we say that uh, variances are when the variances are equal, we are saying that they are homogeneous. And then the alternative, then they are not, they are not equal, meaning they are not homogeneous. So let's find the p-value is greater than 5%. So it means that the findings are not statistically significant variances are homogeneous because we have to retain the null hypothesis. So that proves the next thing we want to do is uh, we want to check the variances and therefore we can say t apply then we say var social we look at the income one then we look at var social we look at the financial literacy and then we say we want to get the standard deviation. So we want to see if actually that is true. And you can see that for the low financial literacy level respondents, the variance, the standard deviation was 17,761, for the medium was 17,220, and for the 17,971, helping us to see that the variances for the three categories were homogeneous. But it doesn't mean that because the variances are homogeneous, it does not automatically tell us that they were earning the same amount of money. Uh, because we could also check on the mean and see if they were earning the same income. And we see that uh, the low income manner, the low people, the people with low respondents with low uh, financial literacy had an average of 67,000. The medium was 64,000 and the high was 66,000, which was not a very big difference between them. And therefore, that is how you test for the homogeneity of variances if you have three factors or more in the data set that you are dealing with.